What's up guys and girls, it's Ghost Robo. We are back with Pokemon Go! I have no idea why I didn't get into this sooner. I really should have. How gooby was I to not start playing this with everybody else because now I'm pretty hooked. And a lot of you seem to enjoy the video, so I thought, why not? Let's just do some more. Uh, so this one involves the evolution party and an update on where I'm at. I'm level 12, as you can see, which is way higher than I was last time, uh, as well as some night hunting, which was really, really fun. So I'm not sure what order they're gonna be in, but you're gonna get night hunting, evolving, and more. But I need to know what team I should join. I've held off. I'm level 12 and I've held off. What freaking team should I join? Valor, Mystic, Instinct. I'm leaning towards Instinct, but I need you to let me know, please. Who should I join? What should I do? Next episode, I'll reveal it to you. But for now, Let's get on with the show. All right, so I've become one of those people, at least for a little while. We found a glorious spot where there are all of these pokey stops, all lured, and I've got incense, and I've got a lucky egg. And so we're going for the bright light shines bright. My hair looks ridiculous. Let's fix that tonight. Um, anyhow, so we're kind of just driving this like simple loop. And because we passed so many pokey stops, we end up getting a lot of things on the drive. Nothing so crazy yet. I think we got a Jigglypuff, a uh, Pikachu, uh, some dumb guys like Raticate, Parasect, a bunch of Eevees. But we're just seeing if we can get something super crazy because again, this loop works incredibly well and we're driving at a speed so that it registers for eggs as well. So this is kind of like a dream come true scenario here, even though I feel incredibly foolish for doing this. There are a ton of people out in this park in theory, doing the same thing we are. There's dumb Paris. This game has literally made me grow so Ugh. sick of Paris, Rattata, Rattata, and Pidgey. And Pidgey. Those are the three that no one wants to see. Uh, Pidgey, of course. But you see how we go through like that pokey stop, like Bonanza room? Like things are just popping left and right. I mean, I'll take an Eevee. Eevee. Because why not? I guess. Sure. It's okay. It makes me kind of already. I think I, I think I'm also ready for like a huge evolution party. So we'll probably do that, or maybe we've already done that, or we'll do it after this. I think we'll do it after this, uh, and I'll evolve a bunch of stuff um, because I haven't evolved anything because I wanted to what save it for a video with you guys. That's oh. a which is a female Nidoran. It looked like an elephant. An elephant. It would be cool if Fanfi was in this game, but they ain't got that series. <laughs> uh, it's only in the first 150. Do you know who Fanfi is? Yeah. You do. I do. Okay. I remember. Just want to make sure you didn't think I was like from my fibbing. cards. Um, this probably is not. I'm very safe. It's like 11:40 at night. No one's on the road, and I'm driving with. Don't do what Zach's doing, though, kids. Yeah. Well, hopefully. Uh, yes. Uh, what you get? Venonat. Yeah, that's okay. But I'm trying to evolve little... it. That's why. No, oh, I don't like Venomoth. It creeps me out. It makes me think of bugs at home. I don't want no bugs at home. So I got four minutes left on my incense, and we're gonna keep doing this loop here. Uh, and what is that? What pop? Cubone. Okay, I'll slow down a little. I'll take the Cubone, and I'm Cubone not. Took? I'm not going for the Pokey stuff just because I have so many of those. There's so many people biking and like walking for Pokemon as well. Mm, Pidgey. Why so many Pidgeys? Where do they all come from? The whole world is full of Pidgey. I don't remember when I watched the Pokemon cartoon. I don't remember Ash running literally into a Pidgey like every ten seconds. That's basically what this is. There are rats and pigeons everywhere. It's a feral world full of vermin. There's another Paris. And Paris, I, uh, Paris are basically like mushroom snails. Again, a, a very gross, well, that'd be crabby. Well, it is a crab. If you look at it, it has claws like a crab. Okay, a crab snail. Okay. A snail crab, a snack rib, a snack, a snacker. A little snacker. Venona, again, saying hello, good day. We'll do the loop. Uh, I got two minutes left on my incense and eggs, so I think we can loop this twice more. It takes about a minute of loop. So we've done probably like 20 of these, which is quite good. Venona, I'm just gonna let you chill. Already level 10, have not picked a team. We gotta do that. Uh, actually, let me know in the comments below what team you think I should join. Instinct, Valor, or Mystic. Now that you have seen their leaders, and realized their worth. Uh, I don't like Mystic at all, so it's either gonna be Valor or Instinct, uh, but make your case. Let me know who I should join in the comments below. I did that on an Instagram post and people flipped. So flip and let me know. And uh, we're gonna hit this loop one more time, rolling through some lured stops, my incense. Sometimes I think the, the Pokemon I find are allergic to incense, and I don't like that. But we're gonna go one more. What's that? Growlithe and hey, Pidgey. Uh, Paris. Freaking France, all up in this zone, and we're not even on the European continent. What gives? 
All right. Oh, he took off. Oh, Pidgey. Oh, there's a giant boss. Let's make sure we don't run into that. I'm gonna grab the Mankey because we're looking for that Primeape action up in here. I can't stand Primeape. Pig monkeys are the the the, the best. They're the, the the pig's monkey. It's like the bee's knees, but the pig's monkey. You know what Pokemon is my absolute favorite, Becca? What? It's the one that rhymes with burlap. Weedle. It's so cute. Uh, okay. Now my guy is zooming along. I tried driving on the highway to burn through eggs. I learned that that doesn't work at all. Um, okay, one more pass through the amazing trail of pokey stops. Okay, there's literally me... nothing good around. More pigeons. Freaking birds for the birds. All right, no it didn't, you Geodude. I don't like Graveler or Golem at all, so I'm not even sure why I'm catching Geodudes. I like Golem. Really? He's just like a circle. Okay, I think he's funny. Okay, screw you, You think he's funny? There's a bunch of really hip, hip, hipsters playing this game. A wild ponyta. You're so flaming, huh? I'm going to ride you with my ice cube. Okay. Well, that's what you need if you're going to ride a flaming horse. Okay. A padding of ice to put out the flame and stave off the heat. It's literally right here. Okay, well, this isn't parking. Arcanine! Where Boom! Ah! Let's get him. No one can hear me. I, I can. It's okay. You're extremely Shredder loud. And freaking... Okay, give him a berry. Eat my raspberry, you razor. Razor razor. Rouser, rabble rouser. It's an Arcanine in the ball. I'm going to catch them all. Please win the freaking jerk. And I threw the ball like literally like an idiot. Come on, come on. Oh my god. Now no. I'm like so He nervous. took off! No way, you kidding? Yeah! He knocked it out of my hand. What a jerk! This is gonna be it. This is gonna be it. I don't know why I'm even excited over this freaking digital pixel. No! Zach and I hated Pokemon Go for the longest time and then we decided to give it a shot. It's like great. Do I get him? I quit out of the app and started again, hoping that it would just like Yes! 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 The guy playing his guitar, do me a solo. There's a policeman right here. Oh God. Probably should leave. All right, now that you've seen me acquiring some of these awesome dudes and dudettes, uh, let's get to evolving. I haven't evolved anybody yet. I wanted to save it for you guys live on camera. Uh, so we're gonna evolve Sparky here into the monstrous Jolteon that we know he can become if they'll let us. You gonna do it? Sparky, you gonna do it? You gonna do it? He's a little nervous. He's just shaking that tail. He's like, I don't know. I don't know if I can. I don't know if I will. I don't know if I can. He, he can't do it. Can you do it? Oh, baby. Took him some time, but he agreed. He finally is powering up. This looks incredibly painful and scary. It's like they're going to be sent off to Witch Mountain in a psychic orb. And then out they pop a different creature. Like, mommy, mommy, I'm scared. And now I have a different body. That would terrify me. It would probably terrify you. But now we got a Jolteon, uh, which is pretty good. Remember, I've done no gym battling, none of that stuff. So I'm not playing the, the, the CP game yet. But 528, okay, thank you. Got a lovely Jolteon action there. Creepy Paris. Gonna give us a Paris sec, because why the heck not? So many Paris, so many Pidgey. So sick of them. Ratatat, Paris, Pidgey. RPP. That is the trilogy of Pokemon that you don't want to see, because they're every freaking where. I'm sure you know this, I'm sure you've experienced it, but we'll take the little guy who doesn't have any pupils. Kind of terrifies me, but it'll be okay. We'll survive another day uh, and see what he's at. He's rocking a 405 CP, that's fine. I'm not gonna really use him for much of anything. How about that Geo dude? Actually, I'm gonna save my candy because I got a Graveler somewhere around here and we need to level him up. Charmander getting close, uh, but Ekans is someone I want to bring to the top. So we're gonna take my little snake-like survivor here and swell him straight into Arbok, who's one of my favorite Pokemon when I was younger. I don't know why, but something about Arbok, it had nothing to do with the Team Rocket Association. I just thought Arbok was cool and looked cool. And boom, baby, there we go. That purple snake cobra action with the face looking almighty and fine. It is, again, not that strong, probably. Uh, sitting at 413. We could power it up if we want to, but we're not going to do that right now. Pikachu, I'm nowhere close. Execute. I'm nowhere close. What about that Meowth action? 
I'm getting close. I gotta get a Persian. All right, so this Pidgeotto here is 318. And I think it would be good to evolve him into a Pidgeot because he's my highest Pidgeotto. Of course, GPS signal not found. All the errors, uh, the distance error. I swear there's a Clefairy error where it keeps showing Clefairy and there's none ever around. And I've done that in multiple cities. And then you go on Pokevision and there's no Clefairy around. Pokevision, if you don't know what it is, I'm sure you do. But if you don't, Lifesaver. Helps you out hunting Pokemon so well. Shows you what's around your area. Refresh every 30, 30 seconds and shows you like how long on their timer so you're not running somewhere wastefully. Uh, but Pidgeot here is 557, rocking and rolling. I like it. His hair is a little much for me, but we need a good bird to power us through this adventure. Just because I want to see Rad because I like him, we're going to evolve the Rad here. 136 candy for this guy. I wish you could sell the candy and convert it into some other kind of candy or at least sell it for like Pokeballs or items. Wouldn't that be sweet? Instead of just having to sit on a pile of rat poop and stuffing your backpack. It's got to smell bad, my friends. It's got to smell bad. But there's Raticate. For some reason, he's always one of my favorite Pokemon cards. Even though it's not a great card, not a rare card. Like, I mean, a very rare card. He's uncommon, actually, in the original set. But I liked him. I don't know if I like him here. He's a little twitching with the teeth. It kind of, kind of gets inside my soul. But, hey, we got another evolution. There's that Graveler I was telling you about. 32 candy, you need 100 of that Geodude candy to take him to Golem. He's not even that strong as just like a baby Graveler that I found randomly, but I don't feel like wasting it uh, on a Graveler. Although maybe I should. Is it better to take a higher level Geodude and turn that into a Graveler and then wait for that to go to a Golem? Give me those tips in the comments, please. Here's the one though I was really most excited to evolve with you, Abra. Got just enough this morning uh, to evolve Abra into Kadabra, and Kadabra is another one of the coolest Pokemon. Alakazam, Kadabra, Abra is such a cool line. I love their look. I like their spoon bending psychoness, and uh, let's see what he looks like. Ooh, yes, Kadabra with that spoon rocking onto my squad and adding him to the Pokedex. We're powering up uh, quite a few dudes. Registering some more. You've seen probably as I've scrolled through some of the guys I've got. I'll do a full collection once I have a, a little bit better of a grab. Right now, uh, I want to just pick a team and get battle in and bring you guys hopefully more videos. If you like them, let me know because I'd love to bring you more. There's some of my guys. I'll show you more of them next time. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. I'll keep these pretty like short and sweet just so they're like bite-sized fun adventures for you. Uh, this one actually might actually end up being long with that night uh, hunting. But those are some of my guys. We're evolving. I really am almost close to evolving Cubone, Meow, some guys I got to go get. And then uh, there's more like this Magnemite here who I popped out of an egg. And I've got eggs uh, as well. Rocking and rolling a 10 kilometer and two fives, as well as some fives and twos, uh, all banked for now. But I gotta clear out my Pokemon bank. I got 182, it looks like. We gotta get there going. We gotta get the GPS signal found. And we gotta get hunting more Pokemon. I know you guys are loving the game. Hopefully, you like me playing it too, because I'm having fun with it. I'm enjoying it, and I know I'm late to the party. But I'm just gonna make some more videos, anyways, because they're fun, and you guys seem to like them. So thanks so much for watching me today. Give a big thumbs up if you enjoyed, and you're ready for the next one. I'll try to get out and about uh, and capture. Pokemon and capture myself uh, rather than just sit here and play the game like in front of a, a table for you. But this one mixes a little bit of that relaxed nature. Level up level 13, lucky 13, beautiful. Uh, and a little bit of that out and about uh, with the night hunting, which was super fun. And we found like the perfect path just to snipe Pokemon over and over and over again. Um, let me know your tips. Let me know your team recommendation. I'm leaning instinct, but help me decide. Till next time, everyone. Drink so much, all things, and I love you. Mwah! And we'll see you all later.